carry-on bag and I'm leaving for Turkey tomorrow but you guys will be watching this video probably once day so I'll already be in Turkey so because I'm leaving like on Tuesday anyways so I carry two bags with me in the carry-on the first bag that I carry is more of like a suitcase kind of carry-on and okay ugh, this one's heavy um, this is how it looks like. This is a Roxy one. I recently bought it because I broke the other one. But it has like big polka dotty things on it and it's just black and oof, ow. it has one big opening here and then a little like pocket kind of thing here and then it has another one here. And then the second bag that I carry on is a handbag and this is the one, I got this from Forever 21 It is pretty much used up, if, I don't know if you guys can see but like it's kind of like weird here and it's dirty and like I like carrying on bags that I wouldn't really care like I just throw them away or just like throw them under the seat or something and like I wouldn't mind them getting hurt Yeah so I've got all of the stuff that I'm going to be putting in the bags there so as I show you guys I'll be putting them in the bags instead of like out of the bags so it's gonna be easier for me I won't have to like put them all back anyways so let's get started by what I put in here okay so in this bag I put all of like the not so essentials but like small things small like beauty kind of related things so the first thing that I have are my sunglasses and these are the aviator ones. I have done a blog post talking about my three favorite kind of sunglasses so if you want to check that out I will link it below. But these are the sunglasses that I like to carry around. These are the aviators and they're kind of like brownish and it's going to be good with what I'm wearing tomorrow. So I've got this and that. Yeah. So I'm just going to pop that in there. Then I've got my actual glasses. Now I wear contacts, but if I kind of want to take them off during the flight because they're kind of getting dry, I'll just be wearing my glasses. And this is how they look like. I, I think you guys have never seen. Okay, this is weird. But like, I think you guys have never seen me with my glasses on. This is how it looks like. And it has a hard case, which I really like so that it won't get like hurt or anything during the flight. It's good. Then I've got Altoids and these are just like some mints that I like to carry around and I don't have a lot of them left in there but I still have some so I just like to put that in the back pocket there. I like to pop some in my mouth. Okay, that sounded wrong. I like to put some in my mouth um, right after we eat or something because I like having fresh breath. And then the last thing that I have in there is my beauty bag where I carry all of this stuff and I'm being careful that nothing really exceeds the 100 milliliter um, like limit. And this is my bag. It is a white bag. It is from Kipling and then it has like three big, I mean two big pockets and then one like smaller zipped pocket in the middle. So in the first pockets they're like just thrown in there. It's not like pocket respected or anything. The first thing that I have here is my L'Oreal Paris um, color shine stain lip balms or whatever. I have done a review of this on my collab channel so I will link my collab channel below so you guys can subscribe on there because we have cool videos every single week and we're posting six days a week so it's pretty cool. And then I have got a white hair tie if I want to tie my hair up. I don't like going out with my hair tied up except like if it's a flight or something I don't know <laughs> and then I've got hand sanitizer and this is the vanilla berry sorbet one and it smells like strawberries and berries and vanilla so it's pretty good and then I have got my Boeing concealer which I have hit pan and I'm trying to use it up so that I can purchase a new one and I like to keep that in my bag so if any zits are coming up I got that and then I've got my favorite lip balm from Bath and Butterworks and 
but yeah, the name is my favorite lip balm. It's not like my favorite lip balm, even though it could be because it's a pretty good lip balm. Anyways, and then in the second big pocket, I have got my um, eye drops. As I said, I'm wearing contacts, so if they get dry or if I get something in my eye, I like to put these. And this is the Contact Lens Multi Action Relief one, so it's this. Good. And then I have got the Sephora Express Kiss Me Baby um, Breath Freshener Spray. It's just a breath freshener spray. As the name says, as I said, I like having fresh breath, so got that. And then I've got a second lip balm kind of thing, and this is from Sephora. It is the unique pink lip balm kind of thing, and this is how it looks like. It looks like a very light pink, but as you apply it on, it kind of gets this like dark pinkish natural color on the lips it's i don't know it's weird and then i've got a second hand sanitizer because you never know when you're gonna run out of hand sanitizer and this one is the sweet p1 and i think that i'm going to be putting this in my suitcase because i'm not sure if i'm allowed to carry two hand sanitizers in one then I've got a hand cream and this one is the I love three dots raspberry and blackberry one and it really does Moisturizes your hands very good. I really like it Yeah, this is a really good hair hand cream and then lastly in the zipper bag kind of thing. I've got my uh, makeup remover wipes and I've also got a roll-on perfume, this is from Zara, and this one is the Wild Orchid one. So that's all of the things that I've got in my makeup bag. I feel like that was like the most interesting thing, so I'm going through all of that. Then, that is all I put in here. I don't like it if the bag gets heavy because I just have to carry it on all the time. So I don't like it. Then in my suitcase kind of thing, I put my camera in its little back, but I cannot really show you guys my camera because I'm filming on it. Yeah. So I put that in there and then I put it in. I will have my like, computer charger, my phone charger, and my camera charger in there too. And then I have got this little book called My Secrets and it's basically a book like I write everything that happens to me every single day during summertime. I don't normally write it but I, I thought that it would be cool during summertime, I don't know. And then I've got my books and my magazines. So the book that I've got here is called Summer and the City and this is talking about like Carrie Bradshaw. But like later on in the TV shows, I don't like the TV shows, so, but I started up reading this book. It's a pretty thick book, so it's gonna keep me occupied. And then I've got this, don't worry, you'll get in 100 winning tips for stress-free college admissions. It basically has like a lot of cool tips in there that will help you get into the university that you want. And then I have got three 17 shoes. This one is the April. This one is the May, and then this one is the June, July ones, and I've got these. And then I have my computer case. This is from Diesel. It kind of looks like a jean, but it's actually not. So I put my computer in here. I've got my earphones, a USB key, and then I've got my hard drive in there too. So I like to carry these around. Last but not least, I have got my phone, and with we should not forget to put that on airplane mode but I like to have it with my second earphones and yeah so those are all the things that I carry in my carry-on bag I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will catch you all later